News and Brief at Press TV. The Israeli military continues to pound Gaza despite international condemnation. Tel Aviv says it has bombarded the coastal strip close to 1,000 times since Wednesday. Over 40 Palestinians, including women and children, have been killed and hundreds of others injured in those attacks. The Israeli army has deployed another Iron Dome battery to Tel Aviv. The anti-missile system has managed to intercept only one-third of the rockets fired from Gaza. The missiles have left three Israelis dead since Wednesday. Palestinian fighters say they're responding to Tel Aviv's deadly strikes on Gaza. Palestinian resistance movement Hamas says it will stand up to Israeli aggression, just as the Lebanese did in 2006. Hamas spokesperson Fazi Barhoum says Israel will have to pay the price for its indiscriminate killing of Palestinians in Gaza. Barhoum said Hamas will not surrender to Israel. Egypt's president is to hold four-way talks with Qatar's Emir, Turkey's prime minister, and a Hamas leader. They plan to discuss Israel's deadly attacks on Gaza. The meeting will take place in Egyptian capital Cairo over the weekend. U.S. President Barack Obama once again reiterates Washington's support for what he calls Israel's right to defend itself. Obama made the comments during a phone call with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. Meanwhile, Netanyahu thanked the United States for its investment in Israel's Iron Dome missile system.